hello hi hi amazing people welcome to the last vlog cleaning session for 2023 yay and today is more of a light clean and go because we are still in the festive season so we are still making head of a mess so i just wanted to start a bit uh, certain things in new you know and entering into the new year i just felt that having a new bedroom bed sheet and all organized that has been you know freshly pressed is the best thing going forward so that's what i started and i got all my bed sheets from demlin and it was so cheap and affordable what well, affordable cheap no because <laughs> my bed size is super king so it tends to be quite expensive but that's what i did today mainly small work and thank you guys for tuning back into my channel um thank you for everyone that have supported me this year of 273 people you guys have been amazing in my journey of growth and i hope that when we go into 2023 you still be here with me and see how we grow and just how we expand this life and you know new adventures so this week we have um my friend and my baby's favorite aunt here with us this weekend so they just came to mess about as i was cleaning you know they gave them joy so i decided to take a minute to just play around with baby she has grown so much this year and her exploration is so good and she's doing so much better um you know learning new things but I appreciated the little break and the mess that they created but it was all in the name of fun. So how are you guys doing? How has your holidays been? Have you had a wonderful holiday time with families? Were you alone? Or oh, you know what is happening? And are you ready for the new 2024 coming about? Um ready and ready-ish <laughs> to be honest with you guys. Um sometimes I feel ready, sometimes I'm not, but you know what? We're just getting into it and we're just doing it. That's the main thing. I'm just doing it you know just one step at a time one day at a time just taking it life as it comes and yeah so this is how the full bed looked like after i did it i really did like the blue and white combination look how pretty it looks oh i did such a good job what do you guys think please let me know then i moved to my favorite place the kitchen <laughs> because today was just a light cleaning so i didn't do my bathroom because i washed it during the week when we had um the christmas period because i had my um, family over and you know it just kept it clean so i was like let me not stress myself too much today i'm just gonna do what i can which was mainly the bedroom that was a mess because our bedroom was old and as well the kitchen which always <laughs> is messy yeah as always i had my divorce court playing i had some cake and hubby was there with me 
or helping me out well basically just talking to me and keeping me company as i was um doing the cleaning because he had to step out for a little bit um but he was helping me the best way he could Now that 2023 is coming to an end, you know, a lot of us to just have time to reflect on what has happened, how the year has been. And to be honest with you, on my side, I felt like the year had just passed me by and I've been focused on the debt, the, the hustles that we've been doing, um, everything and every, you know, it, sometimes I just got overwhelmed and I decided to lock myself up and just be antisocial and just do the bare minimum. But, you know, what? when I decided to start taking this cleaning therapy to heart is when I started feeling better because at least I, knew, I know, like, my mind can be a bit of a mess at time, but ensuring that around me, my surroundings are cleaned, you know, it just brings up that that pride that you can do it you know just one day at a time one room at a time and one step at a time and but before you know it life would have come by and you would have felt much better and just to do a word of encouragement for everyone going through you know depression death loss whatever this year has brought for you because for some people it was probably the best years of their life but for some of us including myself it was one of those years that i struggled genuinely just struggled to keep my head out of the sand to keep my head from being buried i just you know we took a step forward then we took 10 steps backward then we took 20 steps forward been up and down but we started rolling with the pen punches and one thing i did tell myself i've been practicing now is to be more grateful of what i have i don't have the perfect life i don't have the perfect husband and that's why i started actually showing myself on camera because i didn't i wait i wanted to wait until i was a size four a size eight when I've lost all the weight of being, um, you know, giving birth and everything to come out to show, yes, I am perfect. I've snapped back after giving birth. But the reality is I'm struggling to lose weight. I am struggling to maintain, but I'm just taking every day, one day at a time and appreciating every moment I'm alive, every moment I'm awake and appreciating my husband my child my friends my family every single day and one thing that i also started doing whenever i felt feel like i'm going into that headspace where i just start to think about negativity i repeat five things that i'm grateful for just five over and over and over again to remind myself that you know what you're doing all right and I hope for everyone in 2024, as we're about to start, you know, you have a new routine for yourself, a new goal, you know, even if it's just doing one room at a time of cleaning, even if it's folding 10 clothes, you know, even if it's just brushing your hair, whatever the small thing that you are able to do for 2024, just do it over and over and over again and by the time you know it you'll be feeling much better and you'll be feeling more motivated to you know to go about life and life is a journey sometimes we just want to skip ahead but we have to remember this is a journey a long-term journey and 
will be surprised at the end how well it all turns out and i just wanted to say with everything thank you for everyone that has subscribed everyone that has watched me from the beginning until this far i appreciate your support and i look forward for us growing getting better you know in 2024 and i just say happy happy blessed new year and bless your family and everyone and i hope you guys have a wonderful new year with new goals new dreams and all the above Thank you so much for watching my channel and don't forget to share, like, subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.